Malians have been digesting the news that there's finally to be a referendum on whether to update their constitution on June the 18th. It's supposed to move Mali towards civilian rule after a military junta seized power in 2020. It is possible that the campaign for the referendum will be successful in Bamako. But as far as the interior is concerned, such as in the regions, districts and villages, it is not feasible in such a short time. With the biometric card, enough Malians have not received their cards. And for the success of the referendum, we must at least be sure and convinced that Malians have received their cards, so that the mobilization that the authorities and Malians want will be a total success. The military junta has come under pressure from the regional bloc ECOWAS to return to civilian rule. It's also turned to Russia's mercenary group Wagner to defeat the insurgencies after rejecting Western help. The electoral file already exists. We're not in the process of taking a new census. It's just a matter of cleaning up and then reintegrating those who had not reached the age of 18. But this file exists. We're not reinventing it. So it's just a matter today for those who have corrections to make on their information on the identity card to do so in a new enrollment. Or those who do not will have their national identification number card generated as a biometric card. But even if the technical aspects of the referendum do work, Mali's vast size and skeletal road network makes staging it very challenging, even without the insurgencies in the north.